Tamara, what, what do you make of this latest statement from the Conservative Party that they, they won't investigate this until there has been uh, uh, an official complaint? That's right. They are not going to investigate this because no complaint has been made and that is their, their policy at the moment. But certainly uh, this story has caused uh, quite a few ripples across Westminster. Daniel Korski was one of the, can the candidates to be the Mayor of London, the Conservative candidate to face Sadiq Khan in the election next year. Now, he has been accused by a woman called Daisy Goodwin, who is a successful TV writer and behind dramas like ITV's Victoria. She says that she met him in Downing Street 10 years ago when he was an advisor to the then Prime Minister David Cameron. She had met him at an event and she'd been invited to Downing Street to discuss an idea for a TV programme based on government policy. She had a meeting with Mr Korski, she says, and at the end of it, she says that he touched her breast and she asked him, what are you doing? And says that he was embarrassed. She did not mention it at the time, but she has spoken about it since, although she did not name Mr Korski as that advisor. She has written uh, in a piece for a newspaper today that she's decided to go public because he is now uh, in that race and she feels a responsibility, she says, to stop men in powerful positions uh, behaving in that way. Now, Mr Korski categorically denies that this happened. A spokesperson for Mr Korski gave us uh, the following statement. It says, in the strongest possible terms, Dan categorically denies any allegation of inappropriate behaviour whatsoever. He says that it, it didn't happen. Now, he is on a short list of three people to be the Conservative candidate. After working in Downing Street, he went into uh, business and the tech sector, and he, was, he had the endorsements of quite a few senior people in the Conservative Party. But I think the pressure will be on now on Mr Korski. I spoke to a senior Conservative this morning who was one of those publicly backing him, uh, who told me that it feels unsustainable now and they would privately uh, urge Mr Korski to back out of the race. We have not heard any more from him other than that statement from his spokesman. He was uh, reportedly taking part in a public hustings last night when the news came through and he left. I think some decisions will have to be uh, made uh, soon about uh, how he continues uh, to be in this contest. But yes, the Conservative Party, we understand, not currently investigating any complaints because no complaint has been made to them. OK, tomorrow. thank you very much.